Hi friends, today for science, we're gonna do a really fun observational experiment. This is a type of experiment that does not need a science journal because we don't really have a problem that we're solving. We're more just making an observation or watching what happens. Today, we're gonna to learn a little bit about the water cycle by setting up this experiment. If you wanna do this along at home, you'll need a couple of materials and probably help from a grown up or an older sibling. You'll need a plastic bag. It can be a sandwich size or a little bit bigger. This is a quart size. You'll need a permanent marker. Please ask before you use one of these. You'll need a little bit of blue food coloring. Ask for help if you're using this too. And then some type of strong tape, either masking tape or painter's tape, something that can hang this in a window. You're also going to want to find the sunniest window that you have in your house. What we're going to be doing today is we're going to first draw a little bit of a picture on our bag. That's why we have a permanent marker. And then we're going to be hanging our bag in the window after we fill a little bit of water in it. And we're going to watch what happens to water in the water cycle. With the liquid water on the bottom, what's going to happen is in your sunny window, it's going to evaporate into a gas and we're not going to see it. And then it's gonna to start to look like it's raining inside your bag as the water turns back from a gas to a liquid. So this is a fun way to watch how rain is formed. So on your plastic bag, we're gonna do a little bit of drawing. The first drawing we're gonna do is at the bottom and I'm gonna make a little bit of what looks like an ocean. So I'm gonna draw kind of like a squiggly line on the bottom. I might even put some fish in my ocean just for fun be a pond or an ocean. Maybe a little bit of smiles on my fish. All right, so that's what mine looks like now. The little water line and then I have some fish. The other thing we're gonna draw at the top of your bag, we're gonna draw a sun and some clouds. Cause that's where our water is going to turn into a gas. So we have a sun and a cloud at the top the bottom I have my water. And now we're all set to start this experiment. The first thing that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fill this bag with just a little bit of water until it goes to the top of that water line that I drew. The blue food coloring, I'm gonna drop a few drops inside the bag so the water turns blue. If you don't have food coloring at home, you do not need to use it. You can still watch it. It just makes it a little bit easier to see where the water's going. So I'm gonna drop a few of these in the bottom of my bag. I don't have a lot of water, so I probably only need one drop. All right, I'm gonna mix it around a little bit. All right, and we're all set. Now the next thing that we're gonna do is I'm gonna be taping this in my sunniest window in my kitchen. And throughout the day, I'll take pictures of it so you can see what happens. If you've set this up at home, try to find a window that's really sunny or a room that's really warm. It will work a little bit better in your house. It's going to take a different amount of time for everybody. So it's just something you can check on throughout the day and see what's happening. I hope you enjoyed this experiment. And if you did it at home and you want to send some pictures, I would love to see how it worked for you.